So, there is a housing crisis that we can address by building more units in existing neighborhoods, simultaneously meeting our climate commitments and increasing our quality of life. So why the f aren't we doing this? That is our final topic. Well, we still have restrictive zoning and councils don't want to change that. And that is why we haven't built more housing. Thanks for watching. Just kidding. So, yeah, through policy or the views of elected officials, local governments blocking construction is the main reason we haven't made any progress. But that doesn't end the video because policies can be changed and votes can be cast. The city of Victoria is taking a few watered down measures, most importantly, the Missing Middle Housing Initiative. Various levels of government in multiple countries are experimenting with similar policies that open up all single family neighborhoods to more diverse housing types. While Victoria's contains significant restrictions, it can be improved down the line and represents a shift in mindset. Across beautiful British Columbia, municipal elections happened a few months ago, and there have been some major changes in government. If you're a normal citizen, no matter where you are, voting is one way to help, but there are many other ways to shift the narrative. It's no fun understanding an issue if you feel powerless to change it. Find and join local advocacy groups. Engage with governments when they ask for feedback. Visit, call, or write in to public hearings, and voice your support for projects. At these hearings, you will encounter hardcore NIMBYs, a vocal minority that is categorically opposed to nearly all housing, who seek veto power over every project. This is why waiving these public hearings for certain developments is so important. Speaking of major changes in government, we in Victoria have been blessed by a strongly pro-housing mayor and council. They are highly involved in the community and have personal connections to housing advocates. So a message to you, pass and Victoria City Council has recently approved MMHI, the Missing Middle Housing Initiative. So, yep, that's that. It's approved. It is now in effect. As we have discussed earlier, the policy is not perfect. However, I'm excited that we at least have this now. And I'm looking forward to more changes to this in the future, or perhaps a complete replacement that completely overhauls our concept of zoning and permits way more in way more areas. We'll have to see. And that's all I really wanted to say for this video. Thank you, Victoria City Council, for taking this important first step. And a huge thank you to everyone who watched this video, another video in the series, or especially the whole thing. I know the release schedule was absolutely terrible, but I hope that you learned something. And if you did, and you want to share this information with other people, I strongly encourage you to do so. So have a great rest of your day.